Danny, Talia, meet me back at Camp Maximus. Fucking hell, Cyprus are stubborn as shit. See, I think you'll get along just fine. Haha, uh -huh, funny. Just come find me when you're back at camp. You, hmm. I need your help. Fucking Palo says finding a way off Yara is priority number one. <laughs> he wants to run while we got real problems. I heard our friend Matias is locked up in Marquesa's Drew Yarin Academy. He's a doctor, but they took his fucking license for helping us out. It's like it's a crime to help anyone who's not a true Yarin. And now they're going to fry his brain till he's dry humping Castillo. I would know. They tried that brainwashing shit on me. Palo won't risk saving Matias until the heat dies down, but you're up for it, right? Matias is a fucking saint. Don't let Marquesa break him. Dahlia, I'm at the academy. Looks like the inmates took over. Oh, fuck yes! Should make this easy! No, listen to me. The army is here. There's going to be a fight. Then get in there and get Matias out before the army storms the place. The That's what guerrillas are about and shit! Surrender while you have the chance! You're Matias? You don't look like a doctor. What, these scrubs don't scream physician to you? Talia sent me to break you out. Fantastic. One problem? If I let go of this artery, he dies. I need a trauma kit. Guards keep the supplies locked in the pharmacy in the other building. I'll go get it. Rapido, por favor! Yes. 
Have your kit. Get back, fast. Soldados are at our door. Giria, huh. where's that kit? On my way. The trauma kit. Gracias. I need to stabilize him, Danny. Keep the soldados off my back. I, I out for reinforcement. Nobody gets close. Nadie.
Yes. I took care of the soldados. And I took care of my patient. Come see me. You must be here. You did good, um... Danny, from Libertad. You've done this before? No painkillers? Give me a hand. Only true yarns get proper medical care. The rest get me. When I did Paolo's top surgery, there was no anesthetic. Black market hookup fell through. Even then, Paolo didn't blink. Shit. <laughs> Welcome to Castillo's paradise. Tell those lovebirds I'll help after I scrape up some antibiotics for a friend. You will live, thanks to you. Dalia, I got Matias out. Gracias. And Paolo will thank you when he finds out. Danny, you're one of the good ones. Plenty of good ones in Libertad, you know. I think you'd fit right in. Okay, slow down, Danny. If we break more chains, show Marquesa and Castillo that they can't keep us down, maybe I'll consider Libertad. Maybe. Bembe's in the church. Wonder if he's asking for forgiveness. Clara, I need to help Paolo pay off a debt to some black market smuggler named Bembe. Do whatever it takes, Danny. If Paolo was able to build that camp on the run, imagine what he could do for Libertad when he decides to fight. Understood, Clara. Did you see his eyes? Those aren't the eyes of a man of God. I wasn't looking at his eyes. You are hopeless. All I'm saying, if he asks you to confession, don't go. Oh, you could do a lot in a confession booth. Go home to your husband. But I've done so many bad things. I need to talk to God. Castillo, Diego, they all need to go. You Bembe? I know a silly when I see one. <clears throat> What's wrong with Ola, asshole? Try to fuck me, Danny Rojas. I sell your organs to the Yankees. And I know if I shoot you, Paolo's death disappears. No. You have rules. You might kill, but you're no killer. Mierda, you got me. So what does that make you? I kill guerrillas. I also kill soldiers. It's just business. Easy to pretend you're not picking sides. My father was a guerrilla in 67. After the revolution, he put on a crisp military uniform. Three years later, to his surprise, a fresh new revolution with fresh new guerrillas. They thank him with a bullet to the skull. Buried in the same crisp uniform. Are you ready for your uniform, Rojas? It goes both ways. How's that? You were just dressed like a priest. <laughs> I like you, Danny Rojas. We can do business. Fucking Bambe. Dios, I could use a week out of the city. So? Why don't you go? Okay, you Rojas. Stay, no money. I need you to pick up my key from my business partners. Where are they? Get the tent. At the camp. hotel. Camp? I my can't do that. Named it's and easy. Basile. You just They're Russian and they're twins. Make I'll make it easy and send a picture. It's the You're too kind. They say kindness so is the lowest form of manipulation. This is a simple job, Rojas. Get me my key and Paolo will thank you. 
I don't want Paolo's thanks. I want Paolo's debt cleared. We all do, Rojas. Me most of all. Right. I'll get you this key. But then you and Paolo are square. Understand? Love you, Rojas. Bye-bye. Hola, Rojas. I thought you should know that there might be some soldiers at the hotel. Might be? Hey, I'm just trying to help you. You don't help people, Bembe. You use them. I'll take that as a thank you. I see a Russian, but is it Dmitri or Vasily? Fumigator. Afilados. You find who it is? Help me! Cuidado, esta es peligrosa. What do you want? Are you Dimitri or Vasily? Dimitri? Who the fuck are you? Bembe sent me. Where's the key? <laughs> so that's what this is about. Bembe fucked us good. First he sends military, then he sends you. I don't work for Bembe. I'm just here for the key. My brother has the key. The soldiers drowned him like a dog, but he didn't once beg for his life. He died in that fancy pool, like a man. My Vasily. Gracias. I'm sorry about your brother. I'm getting out of Yara. You should too, before Bembe stabs you in the back. Idiota Kusok! I never should have come to this godforsaken country! Bembe, you fucking hijo de puta. Ah, so you got my key. See, I found it on your dead Russian friend. Now, Rojas, the key opens a safe at Via Judia Hotel. I need the black book inside. What's in that book? For you? Paolo's freedom.
Perfecto. Better watch myself here. Let's grab a ride. American weapons. Shit. Libertad could use those. Should check it out. Juan. Got a lead on a weapon shipment. American. Interested? Interested? Daddy, I'm having a hands-free <laughs> orgasm in this church. Call me when you find them. Gross. But, uh, yeah, okay. Engineer spotted. The safe's in the restaurant. Bembe, it's done. I got your book. Muy bien, Rojas. I can see why Clara has so much faith in you. You are such a good little gopher. Is that what you think I am? Prove me wrong. I don't have to prove anything to you. Tell me where to meet you. I'm across the north bridge of the hotel.
All this for a book. Buen trabajo, Rojas. Thank you for securing my new port. Thought you wanted the book from the safe. Can't a man have both? Of course, Via Hudia Hotel is the real price jewel. It's the best smuggling port on the south coast. You just needed someone to clear out the competition. The Russians made good money from this place. And with this book of corrupt officials in their pay, that money will now flow to me. We are done here. But you and I still have business to do, Rojas. You've paid off some of Paolo's debt. But not all. Don't worry, I have more work for you. Meal for the army? I got some customers who are dying to get out of paradise. You're going to help them do that. I've left you a truck. Use it to drive my customers to the docks where our ship will be waiting. The docks are guarded, so you're going to work a little harder to get past them without a fight. That's where Rafael Merrero comes in. He's a forger and a very important client of mine. His papers will get you through. Do this for me, and Paolo's debt is wiped clean. Everyone wins. When the boat leaves, the boat leaves. Paolo, just spoke to our mutual friend, Bembe. What did that snake have to say? He says I do this one last little job for him, and you walk away clean. I'm not proud, but I do it again to get Talia and me out of Yara. Danny, I know the risk you are taking for me. I won't forget this. Thank me if I get through this in one piece. Hostage. Danny! Danny, Danny, Danny! <laughs> what do you want, Picho? Nothing. No, that's wrong. It's definitely something. I promise. Meet me back at the camp. I got an idea. Bye! Dinga. We let this got them. Bembe. Why is it everywhere you send me I find trouble? Speculation is a waste of time. And time is money. Take matters into your own hands, Rojas. And fast. Rafael is there somewhere. There's the officer in charge. Gracias. Vamos. Oye, mío, por favor. Gracias. 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 They're in the truck nearby with Bembe's customers. You better hurry. What about you? I'm going back to my studio. I have more art to create. Bembe, I got your... clients... and your papers from Rafael. Okay, Ross. Now, make sure my precious cargo gets to the port. Si. Sí. Okay.
Everyone good back there? <laughs> Vámonos. Yeah, I'm in the truck. Boss waiting. Try not to damage the goods. Goods? I got a truck full of people here. No, Danny. That's a truck full of money. My money. Papers. Wait a minute, Christmas trees? Do we even grow those here? Mexicans pay crazy money for this. How you think El Presidente funded Maria's new face? Okay, go through. Bembe better be here. Rojas. I'm sure our friends here will be very appreciative. Ah, momento, amigos. This isn't your stop. Que coño, they're not going? Business expense. What the fuck does that mean? My talent is commerce, Rojas. Why don't you leave that part to me and you can focus on your talents? Run back and tell Paolo he has my permission to leave. Vaya con Dios. Paolo, good news. Bembe is off your back. That was one hell of a debt you owed. Gracias, Danny. We keep this between us. Talia hates everything Bembe represents. I owe you one. But Talia and I are still getting off this island. Paolo's busy again, isn't he? Hola, buena. He sent you to help me? Like to see Paolo pick up a hammer. I don't know you. Yo, it's my favorite guerrilla! <laughs> so you know, I'm a badass radio DJ. Okay, that's a lie. But you inspired me, Danny, with your guerrilla -ness. I dream of my sexy voice. Maximus Matanza's music and Libertar's message all over the airwaves. I call it Radio Libertar. I dream of you spraying a logo all over Maria Marquesa's shitty propaganda. Here's spray paint and some bombs I made to make handing out flyers go way faster, okay? Counter propaganda right into the machine. <laughs> I got chills. You feel it down there? No, it's just me. Oh, okay, cool, cool. Yes! Oh, I can't wait to tell him Paulo see this shit!
Hey, bicho. I'm at segunda. <sighs> About fucking time. You're slower than my shits after I ate too many platanos. I swear to God, bicho. What you waiting for? Spray the posters, plant the bombs, get the fucking word out. Radio Libertad is waiting to be born. Correle, chop chop. Ooh, looks good. I think I might have a career here. Good spot for Beatrice's flyer bomb. Planting explosives in a public area. What could go wrong? Throwing out some trash. Nothing to see here. Hello there. Oh shit! <laughs> Bombs away. <laughs> Castillo. <laughs> Castillo. Bicho, going pretty good so far. Nice logo. Gracias. Just keep those edges clean, okay? I got it, Bicho. Like, keep your wrist loose, okay? Smooth I got it. it oh, I love you. The wealth it provides. Is a cure for the cancer of socialist poverty that almost destroyed our nation's future. Viviro is progress. Viviro is life. Viviro is hope for every other. All citizens should be able to take two types of identification at one time. It requires that they present their identification to the ejército or the police if they are solicited. I'm good. One more. I'm watching you. Pinga. You idiot. Hi. Put the hey. weapon away, Singal. All literary, what? auditory, and performance based works of art must be submitted to the Ministry of Culture for approval. The performance or dissemination of any unapproved works will result in arrest and imprisonment. A true yarn seeks justice, progress, and vision. Check that one out. Bicho, I'm done. No, 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 man. You're not done. Are you ready for the next step? I'm ready. Okay, so Maria's on her way. There's a banner she's gonna unveil on live TV. And you are gonna swap it out for our banner instead. Oh, I am. <laughs> am I? It's high up, but you can get there, right? And you, you think Clara's gonna like it? Yeah, go team! I'm into it. Go team. 
cualquier persona quien propaga deliberadamente la información falsa que interrumpa el orden social se enfrentará con consecuencias serias. Hello, my beautiful foreign friends. Any questions before we begin? Minister Marquesa, are you concerned that- How do you respond to rumors that Diego Castillo is your son? I don't. Diego Castillo is the first son of Yara and an example to all true Yarens. Now, it is my pleasure to unveil the construction of the Anton Castillo True Yaren Cultural Center. Pájenla inmediatamente. You see? This is the kind of cultural pollution we are fighting against. Ah, uh, we just need to borrow your phones and your cameras. <laughs> Everyone in Yara saw that shit! Oh my god, Danny! We have so much to do! I'm blowing my own fucking mind! 